guys, I try to be honest almost all the time regarding the future for Crusty Girls. Today, I made my video that there hasn't been any update on no release YouTube video of a Crusty Girls on the channel. But after watching this tweet, which is after a Crusty Girls Spring Breakdown premiered, it is revealed that Spring Breakdown will be the final special. There's not going to be a season 3, and I don't think there's going to be a 5th movie, because I'm really starting to see the odds of the situation. They didn't even have a plan for a movie whatsoever. Anyway, Nick said it ended up being the final special, although we didn't know it would be at the time. We even had plans laid out for a second season finale special and a third season. But things didn't work out. You know, when you see this stuff, you know this isn't fake. This is serious. This is one of the people who have been working on the special. And considering of how Equestria Girls was after Legend of Everfree, it's really no surprise on to why it's ending this way. I really just... I just don't know what to say. I mean... Once everything is uploaded on YouTube when it comes to the digital seasons of Season 2, there's really nothing else that this show can do in order to continue. And at this point, I'm really mostly disappointed. Not that I want a third season, but people deserve a third season, or at least have this show to have the spinoff to go on even after the show comes to an end and Friendship is Magic. But... I literally just don't even think that this is pretty much a good idea f to have an actual finale. I don't even want to hurt anyone else's feelings because what if I'm going to make a video involving like that, it will probably be the worst truth of them all. And just by remembering the what Sunset's Backstage Pass has to offer is literally what they have left when it comes to the ideas of when it comes to Across Your Gores. I really just don't like of how most of the endings, mainly the flashlight plot, has no closure. The 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 magic going out of the statue from Cantalot's highest court lord never being resolved whatsoever. And not only that, my fan surface could be much more better than what Spring Breakdown did. And I'm really serious. I really, th this really hurts me in the inside to actually think that this is actually true news and not something that was actually fake. Seriously, you can say all you want that there could be a chance, but I don't think it will be a possibility that will happen. I just think that this is the information that I literally just give up on. A Crusty Ghost continuing on after Season 9 is officially over. And what makes this even more sad is that next year there's not going to be any My Little Pony content whatsoever. We just need to accept what we have when it comes to Season 9 and the other seasons. Which really makes it really depressing for me to actually think that this is literally what all comes down to. It just really does. And I really felt that this is pretty much what people just literally cannot, cannot even think of what they're going to do next after Across Your Girls. I'm feeling this way because Across Your Girls maybe became a brony. And I want to have my fan service actually take full effect other than what Spring Breakdown did. But considering that the reasons on to why other specials that Sunset was not the main character, they will not gain much attention. Mainly the 22 minute specials and four calls of friendship and spring breakdown. And if you guys saw my review on Across Your Girls Future that I that was part of my review of Sunset Spaxage past last month, I really think that that theories on my across your ghost on across your ghost future is probably the most outdated thing on that video because I really just cannot even take of how this is what it all comes down to 
and when we don't usually get an actual finale from this show, I just really think that A Quest to at least deserves a finale. Like, like if there's not going to be a third season, make it make the fifth movie and make it the final movie. That's literally the only way you can wrap up A Quest to Ghost because the Quest to Ghost start off with the first movie in 2013. And the last movie we had was The Legend of Everfree, which was three years ago. And I really miss those times a lot. Because those movies actually continued the plot and the situation involving the Questia Gores. But what the fact is, is that when people aren't recognizing that the statue isn't linking magic, that has been a thing since three years with no resolution, that is just really sad. Really depressing. Yes, we did get some information that there's a possible fifth movie from 2017, but at the same time, we still didn't get any news of it. As far as I'm concerned, I just think that they should probably work on the fifth movie and then just wrap it up. At least that would give us something that we've been wanting to see, because the fifth, because movies with an hour long would give so much development on everything. Because believe me, I just really cannot take the stress of seeing the specials, not continuing anything, and nothing but occupation. Which is something I thought that the shorts was going to do instead of the movies. Instead of, you know, instead of the specials. Anyway... I really don't know what else to say. I'm really, really depressed to the point that even if I can do fanfic stuff, like I've been uploading over the last three weeks, it still isn't enough. What keeps me motivated onto writing those fics is because it actually gave me some of the ideas of what could actually happen with the events that happens in the Crusier Gauze. And I really think that with some of the ideas that I did, even if you haven't read them, actually happen. Like, Rainbow's personality in Spring Breakdown, I actually made her more, you know, more self-aware than what she was portrayed in Spring Breakdown. And as for Pinkie Pie, well, she gets distracted, like, literally all the time, even though that I made her completely ignore his, her, her partner during Valentine's Day. But... With this, I'm really broken on the inside, and I'm really serious. It just really makes me really depressed on how this is going to be ending up, probably at the end of this year, because if we get more evidence, we're probably going to be a lot more sadder and a lot more worse when it comes to 2020, since there's not going to be any contact in 2020. I really got nothing else to say. I pray there's going to. I pray that there has to be a fifth movie to wrap up the series. If there's not, then we really don't know what else to expect. Show sure, reboots can be a thing, but as far as I'm concerned, if I don't think I'm going to enjoy the reboot of how it's going to be played out. Anyway, I'm lonely fan by Fully Hill, and I'm really sorry. This is what comes to this. What it all comes down to this.